Welcome back. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to. Oh, are you yelling at me now? Okay, so Henry really wants to go outside. Henry, do you want to go outside? Is that what you want to do? Go, run. You know what? Hold on. Oh, there's a ball out here. Guys, so this is my dilemma with letting Henry out in my backyard. He eats all of the wood chips under this playground. And I don't know how to stop him from that. So if I come out here, I have to like literally chase him around so he doesn't go straight to the wood chips. Henry, look, you want the ball? Go that way. It just sucks. Like, why do I have a backyard then? No, I love a backyard, but I'm just saying like, a backyard is convenient when you have a dog, but if he eats the damn wood chips and gets sick, then what's the fucking point? Henry, no, <laughs> do not. You see, he's already eating them. He's eating them. Also, would like to say that this mother effer is faster than lightning. Wow, well, we actually grabbed him. I've never grabbed him. Okay, Henry, what do you have to say to the camera? What'd you do? Yeah, you're licking your lips because you just eat the wood chips, huh? Henry! Sick. You did such a good job. Oh my goodness. Guys, I left Henry outside. Cause look what he's doing, he's so funny. He's just literally sunbathing in the grass. So I just left him out there. Cause he's not eating all the wood chips. So I was like, okay, cool. Also, I'm gonna give Anne Marie her birthday present today. Her birthday is on Wednesday, but I just am like so impatient when it comes to gifts. I love giving people gifts like immediately. Cause I'm just annoying like that. We got cute, it is wrapped. I feel like the wrapping job isn't the best, but you know, it's good. I'm just gonna tell you guys what it is because she's gonna see it at the end of the day anyways. It's a pair of sneakers. They're really cool sneakers. They're from a brand called, I don't know what they're called. I don't know how to say it. I eat, eat, itis, itis, itis or itis, I don't know. Anthony helped me pick them out because he was like, yo, these are so cool. I was like, okay, sick, I'll get her these sneakers because she, I know she's been wanting like new shoes and stuff. So I'm gonna give them to her later. But right now I need to eat food. And guess what I'm eating? Cause I always eat this. Actually, no, not always, but it's always a kind of food. It's a leftover. <laughs> it's a leftover cause you know that I don't eat anything else other than leftovers, which is awesome. I got a breakfast burrito yesterday. I ate half of it yesterday and I'm gonna eat the other half right now. It's a vegan breakfast burrito. It's from like a local cafe. It has tofu in it, potatoes, black beans, guac, which kind of sucks that I have to heat up the guac, but it's like in it, so whatever. But I can't, I get vegan breakfast burritos because I'm, I don't wanna say I'm allergic to egg, I always say it, but like, I have just a sensitivity to egg, and when I eat egg, I break out. I mean, I'm breaking out right now, but that's cause it was that time of the month. So yeah, so I have like a sensitivity to eggs, so I always get like vegan breakfast burritos if I can, if possible. If not, I just take the egg out and just like load in like potatoes, cheese, just the, the works. I don't know what the f I'm saying. Okay, burrito. Oh, no, I don't want to put that there or it'll f***ing fall over. my food now my mom's calling me please hold so i got a celsius it's kind of like an energy drink it's probably not the best for you but <laughs> i'm drinking it because i have hot yoga in like an hour and sometimes i just need a little pick me up for that i've only had one cup of coffee today i need something or else i'll like not fall asleep in the class but maybe tip over from just how not there i am but also this is my favorite flavor it's the fuji apple pear it's so because the burrito is so thick, like thick with three C's, the middle's probably cold, but I can never get it warm enough in the middle because I don't want to like make it too hot. So I like just eat it kind of cold in the middle, but it's fine. It's not like it's raw or anything. Then I get like this like chipotle mayo that comes with it. So good. Mm, it's actually not that cold. I don't know why I don't eat out here more often. It's like so nice. I feel like I mean, granted, it's been winter, but winter in LA is still so beautiful. It's like 70 degrees, and I feel like we just don't take advantage of our backyard that often. But what also sucks, in my last vlog you guys saw, we haven't been able to figure out how to use our hot tub, so we have someone coming to show us, I think tomorrow or Tuesday. Zamri's birthday is on Wednesday, and we want to use it. Like, we got to use it before it gets too damn hot, too. I'm like, what do I talk about? What's going on in my life? Not much. <laughs> Seriously, it's so funny. After a week of like not talking or not seeing them, they're like, so what's new? Like what's going on? And I'm like, 
literally nothing like my life really isn't that crazy like yesterday was saturday and i just was at home all day like i deep cleaned my bathroom cleaned my room i vacuumed i went to target got cleaning supplies and like some candles laid in bed like seven to eight o'clock rolled around i wrote a little bit read my book journaled and i was like perfectly content with that and I'm like, is that adulting? I can't tell. Or is it just like I'm getting over everything? Because I know people that are older than me that still like go out and like want to go out. And I'm just like, I don't know. I feel like I go through like eras of like wanting to go out and then like it's just too much. I don't know. LA's weird, guys. LA's a weird fucking place. Let me tell you. It just burns you out fast. You're just like constantly wanting, not even wanting. I feel like you're constantly like, you constantly feel like you need to be like keeping up with everyone and everything at all times, whether that's going out or social media or like a look of some sort and it's like i feel like you just are trying so hard all the time that you get to a point where you're like i don't i don't freaking care anymore and you're just like i'm just like not gonna worry about it and then you do things like what i did last night where i'm like i don't want to do anything because i'm exhausted i'm done ranting about me doing nothing <laughs> Guys, sorry, let me just pop right back in here real fast. Um, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of the app, The Pattern. If you want to be yelled at every day, then you can get it. If you don't want to be yelled at, then don't get it. But it's basically like an astrology app. It kind of, you know, based off of your signs and like your rising, your sun, your moon sign. Just kind of how like you're affected by what's going on at the moment. But I just wanted to show y'all that look at how it yells at me. So it says reality check. That's the title of my notification. And it goes, today you might notice that your thoughts are heavy or you've been too hard on yourself lately. What was I just ranting to you about? I just, I was like, I'm just like so exhausted. I don't wanna keep up with LA anymore. And that popped up two minutes ago. Yeah, like I said, if you don't wanna get yelled at, dark maroon on and maroon fuzzy slippers and i'm all black do you think they can even see i don't know i can't see <laughs> do i really look like that yeah we, we both oh my gosh like i'm this. so pale i just i feel like i'm not Ugh. that pale but i just look so pale right now i don't know why guys we're on our way to hot yoga don't look mayor pits <laughs> we're a little nervous for this class because this is a yeah, it's what is like, it called? It literally. Okay, I have to look at it because the way it was worded, I was like, "Sorry, what?" Graduate, like free. First of all, free. So we're like, is everyone and their mom gonna be there? Yeah. So we're like trying to get the free a sculpt early. class taught by graduates. So I said graduates of UCLA, <laughs> of no. USC, or graduates of like hot yoga, like they used to teach at Hot Eight, and now they're coming back. No, I know. I think I think it's like a like the course, like literally graduating from the like. <gasps> The sculpting course because they do it yeah. like for because in all of our classes they'll be like we're gonna teach a sculpting or like a hot yoga yeah. course and we'll be talking to some of you that we think would be like a good fit yeah you bet your ass i almost did it just kidding but i think it would be fun <laughs> just kidding just kidding they would never ask me because i'm can't even make it through a full class so that's why marie and i were like we're just gonna do it it's either like gonna we're like i feel like it's either gonna be a great class or it's gonna be really bad or i'm gonna be really angry when i walk out and feel like i didn't get a workout at all <laughs> no it can't be that bad like i like i just feel like no matter what because we're in like a hot yoga studio either way you're just gonna sweat a lot no either way it'll be a workout yeah. i just like there's like specific teachers i like i'm just picky but <laughs> I don't know. Honestly, the only reason we're doing this one, we're like complaining about it, but the only reason we're doing it is because we can't do the five o'clock one. Yeah. So we had to stick to the two o'clock. And we haven't been in like two days and we've been really good about going. So. Because you bet your ass I'm spending half a bank account on that. So. <laughs> so we better be going. <laughs> oh. You gotta tell me when you're recording, I'll be saying some shit I shouldn't <laughs> say.
I just wish there wasn't so much coconut in it, you know? All right, guys, we got done with hot yoga. It was just too much. It was really intense today. It was really intense. Well, I thought I called Franny earlier and I was like, are you sure you want to go to this one? And then we found out that it was like, their the graduates their last class so like friends and family were in it and it was like packed which makes the room hotter usually it was a good class like i definitely felt like i worked out yeah it was just a lot because it they, all, really they alternated from five different instructors throughout was the class it, i thought it was six maybe six. it was a lot there was just a lot of moving pieces and a lot of people talking at, all, at once so it was like congrats on the graduates Hey, congrats. I <laughs> passed away in that class. I almost blacked out like three times. Oh. Okay, so we came to Air One to grab smoothies. That's my first time in Air, Air One, is what I call it. Hair One. Hair One. It's kind of, ch it's too much coconut, but it's pretty good. Emery bought, what is it, golden kiwis? Mm -hmm. I've never had a golden kiwi. Okay, so my sister like feeds these to Emmy all the time, her baby. I saw them and I was like, Franny, you have to try these. These are unreal, because I tried them when I was home for Christmas. Five, six, seven, eight. Mm -hmm. Whoa, I feel like I just ate a really soft potato <laughs> These ones aren't as sweet as ones my sister had like cut up, but maybe it's like the mix with this Is this just throwing it off? I mean, it's really good. It just tastes kind of like a well, they don't taste like kiwis They're like no like a sweet potato No, no, but not, not, not like a sweet potato, but like a potato like a regular potato but sweet what? That's not what they taste like, you guys. And then Amory got a, what is it? There were so many coffee options. I had to get one. So I got the Califia. Califia. I know this brand and I get it and I still can't say it. But I got the cold brew with almond milk and it's salted caramel flavor. Give us a review. <sighs> yep. 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 Guys, I don't know how I feel about this smoothie. It's so chunky. Chunky monkey. <laughs> Kind of making me gag. Oh. Then we turn this off. Oh wow. What does that have to do with anything? What doesn't have to do with anything? Ew. Oh. <laughs> He's like directing this vlog. Right it's a here. vlog. So right here. Then we both sit like this. We <laughs> look. <laughs> okay, Am. Open up your present. I just want you to know. It's... Why did he have to be here? Why did we have to wait so long? Because I helped pick it. He helped pick it. Like, I kind of knew an idea. Of, like, Fran doesn't know what's cool, so she asks me no, what's no, no. cool. No, no, no. So I had an idea, but I was like, okay, Auntie, do you think this is a guy? He's like, no. And I was like, okay. I feel like I know what it Are those is. Those chicklets? No, I feel like I like, know. Like, you know what it is, but you don't know what it is. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, but you don't know. Like, you know, but you don't know. Like, you would know, but like, you would never know. No. You got happy birthday wrapping paper at home? I bought it. Just for this? Yeah. She wrapped it. Can I borrow it later? <laughs> <laughs> You're kidding. I literally knew what it was going to be. Mm -mm. Yeah, didn't. white sneakers. No. Yeah, but you didn't know. They're not Trust white. you. You don't know. Because I asked him, hey, mind hey. you, a week ago, I was like, hey, can you send me some good white sneakers to wear? Because he hates my Nike Air Forces. And I kept asking Air Force him, he wouldn't don't. send me, he wouldn't send me any recommendations. He thinks the Air Forces are done. They're not. They're done. I'll We've reached their conclusion. <laughs> I'll continue to wear them. It's just because Anthony's a fashion icon and he knows what's cool. I don't a even great know. You brand. still don't even know what I'm they gonna are. Be you honest, never, you, I'm going to be honest. Trust me. You're going to no, be No, I know. I like this brand though because those are the ones you're, this yeah, is your yeah. chunky stuff. This so. is my brand. Okay, but wait for it. It's not your brand. When I tell you, I don't even know how you just opened this so easily because I was trying to open it. You couldn't figure it out. I couldn't figure it out. <laughs> Edie's. Send us all the stuff. Oh, is that how you we, call it? We yeah, wear, they're from their we, UK base. We brand. wear it all the time. Okay, I'm opening it. I'm scared. Me too. What? I showed you these, did I not? No, I showed you them, Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, I showed you these. Maybe I showed you them. Oh, no, I showed you the buffalo ones. Kick rocks. Oh, these are fucking so Those are cool. Yeah, they're the yeah, way cool. Whoa! What do you mean I didn't know what they were? I literally you said knew, We speakers. both said you knew what they are, but you didn't know what they are. Amory let everyone wanted this, they're not white, even ties, chunky, chunky, sneakers. white sneakers. I guess they are white. I forgot what color they were. Because they like to be taller than I am, even though I'm tall. Fran! You're welcome! These are sweet! First of all, I have a missiles. fat foot. Just trust. Trust minute. what? <laughs> Let's zoom in on these on these puppies. So okay, Dude, so I'm it was either knock people out with these things. So it's it was either a size eight or nine. I know you're an eight, right? These are nines. No, no, these are eights. Yeah, yeah. I'm an eight. Yeah, but, I know. But some. These, but sometimes they're yeah, a little yeah. snug. But I got you the eight oh, because they are chunky. Do you know what you I mean? You got a size nine. No, those are eights. I would. I know, but I'm saying if you got a nine, I would look. 
baby. Pull the light. You're, you're pissing me off. <laughs> you're pissing me off. Can you get in here? Look at this. She's stepping on the back of it. You just got him, dude. Hey. Get in there. Jeez. And then look. And then you pull this tight. And then you pull that tight. You're pissing and then me you, off. And then you put that under there. They're like snug, but I think it's just because my toenails are long. Well, no, I because I think a nine would have made your foot look like. I would have clown feet. <laughs> Cool as hell, my dog. They don't make me look like I'm like. No, you large. look freaking cool. Franny, these are fing sick. Thanks, Anthony, help Thank me pick you. them out. You're welcome. Oh, the way she's walking. Yeah, what are you doing? <laughs> no, I don't walk like that. With the shoes? Come on. Hey. Hey, that's a baddie. Wow. Also, you're like wearing First vlog in my house, I am Francesca Arietta. You give him, you just give him an inch and he takes a mile. Hey, comment in the comments if I'm Francesca Arietta. No. Okay, watch what I say to Vincent. Watch this. Grab the key. Vincent, Vincent. No. Oh, you are. I'm doing it. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Do you need <laughs> to go out? <laughs> oh. He took off. He's so Welcome to my house. Comment below if you want a house tour. Comment below if you want this channel to be taken over by me, the real Francesca Arietta, for the, the amount of time of two That's days. That's all you know what to say. I'll huh? take it over for two days if Franny wants me to for the cost of $100,000. $100,000? That's how much it will be. $100,000. For you to take my channel? Uh, that's me. That's fine. That was enough. I did what you wanted me to do. Yeah, you were funny. So this is what happens when you eat dinner at 5 in the afternoon. That's like lunch for us. And now it's 11. Uh, almost 11? 11.45. It's midnight? Yeah. We left Anthony's at like 11.15. Yeah, we're not doing well because we got it at like 7. We're going to Disneyland tomorrow. No. And now we're baking some no. nuggies. Gluten free nuggies and even chips and salsa. All right, guys. We're gonna eat and probably head to bed at like one in the morning. <gasps> I'm gonna knock out. That's still like six hours of sleep. Yeah, that's not bad. No. Okay, bye. Right. Mwah. Say bye. I don't know why my face is so red. Mm. Say bye. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mm -hmm. Ew. <laughs> what the?